Cairo has its own intro, mm -hmm. which is this. Okay, that's gonna be on the intro. Then right? I took. Okay. So this is an intro that I found on YouTube. Yeah. I think it's really good. And where'd you find it? Um, Colorful 3D blender into template. Okay. Oh, I didn't look that up, but yeah. All right. Well, what do you do next? Then Go you click find on, it. Uh, the description mostly it's there. Mm -hmm. Click on the link. It's again a mega. I like mega because like you're guaranteed to get it. Um, but not guaranteed to work. But okay, download through bro browser. Browser. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Then it downloads. It's pretty fast. Is oh. it code? I guess it's code to have a Blender. Well, per uh, the person first does it 3D in mm -hmm. Blender. And then saves the files that makes it. And then you go down to open. Mm -hmm. And it just immediately opens in opens Blender. In Blender. Oh, that's pretty good. You want to get it so you can actually see the name perfectly. Alright, so you're scrolling back. Then you right through. click it until you see this yellow. Mm -hmm. Then you click on tab, press backspace. You might not go away, but. Gadget. Gadget. And then you click on tab again. And do as many times as there are these words. You might, don't want to. Uh, I think it, the G just has that appearance because there's something behind it. No, you want to get that something behind it. Uh, but can you play it a little bit to kind of move things around? Wait, I'm get There you go. And then you oh, click on mm -hmm. Gadget. And then click on Tab again. And you pretty much already have your intro, but not rendered. That's pretty good. And then... And all the other stuff will be coming in later? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then you move over here. I see what you have. Mm -hmm. And then... You look at the file, so it's a H.264. Okay. That means you scroll up and click on render. Mm -hmm. Blender render. Then it'll do this. So now it's rendering? It's rendering, yeah. And this goes on for a while? Well, depending on how I many... I can see pile in the reflection. I can see who you are. Look at sky bro. Okay, so first thing I want to make sure that goes so all the way in the front, the mm -hmm. and then you go on this and to drag it all the way out so you can see how long. So it's 290, so that's about, I would say, 40 minutes. Mm -hmm. okay. And then you click on render, uh -huh. that's 40 minutes of rendering. Uh -huh. And then to, to see, see this little green thing, uh -huh. Uh -huh. that will move through. So right, it renders yeah. three scenes, and then it moves only one second. So it has to do three scenes, and wait, it didn't work. Uh, oh wait, never mind. Instead, when it's a H.264, H. Mm -hmm. look on animation. If uh, it's an AVI file, then you click on render. Okay, oh, so okay. that's working now. So then you look at the green. And, and it just happens over the next uh, hour or so. Yeah. Or however long it takes. Right. Yeah. Well, thanks. That's very helpful. So after you've rendered it, mm -hmm. which you can tell, so I'll just click on this real quick. So it says render up here. Mm -hmm. And after, when this is gone, then you know it's completed with rendering. Okay. So what you do is close it. Mm -hmm. You want to press cancel, but before you press control S, which is save, mm -hmm. click on save over, click on whatever your name is down here. Then you click on X. And closing then, Blender. And then, since it's saved, it'll be right here. Well, where is here? What? Is well, this, um... on whenever, wherever you want to save it. Is that was that decided beforehand? Yeah, is and okay. then um, you click on. So it was called. This is the file that I was rendering, mm -hmm. and then you click on it. And this Wait. is a movie file. It's an AVI file. Yeah. Here. So how we are going to do a screen recorder. So I have Bandicam. You just downloaded that from the internet? Yeah. It's free? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I, you can click on games. Like mm -hmm. I'm just going to open Minecraft real quick mm -hmm. right here. Okay. And then um, when you click on the little game icon, recording it yet. And then it says win alt T to show or hide the recording timer. So mm -hmm. Bandicam is saying that. So it says please click the recording target window. So then I click on. Oh, and it just records that one. Now I That's click on it. Works. For example, I'm just going to shrink this down. 
while it's recording. And then make a little arrow going like this. Okay, now let's play it back. And now I will type in Blender intro. Mm -hmm. And then zoom out and see if it works with okay. my voice. So, paused it, and now let me make it stop. Then you go back on Bendycam, and you click on Output, then the video. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna close okay, it. how's that? And now you can actually record everything that's inside the box. For mm -hmm. I'm not talking, okay, by the way, right now. So you While it's recording. And I have the little... And then make a little arrow, it's going like this. Yes, yeah, his mom's calling that cat. Okay. And now, I will type in Blender intro. It was a little distorted, but that's okay. And then, zoom out. <laughs> yeah, you want to keep wow. it in a good ratio. 